Many people who use Speechify ask, can you add books from Kindle or iBooks? The answer is kind of. Um, it's a little bit difficult, but you can manage it if you really want to. Um, all of these books comes from, come with DRM, so digital rights management software, um, but there are ways of getting rid of them. For example, for Kindle books, um, you can search in Google Apprentice Alf. Um, Alf is A-L-F um, in Google, and you'll find links to DRM removal software. You can do the same thing um, for, for example, like .mobi. Um, Kindle books often require an extra step to convert .mobi to .epub. Um, the other way you can do it is just open the Kindle app if you have it on your phone, and this will you something you can do chapter by chapter with often. Highlight the section that you want, and then keep your finger here on the bottom, and it'll start flipping the pages for you. And just hold, hold it like that until you get, let's say, 10 pages at a time, 15 pages at a time. So that was a chapter, I'm gonna stop there. I'm gonna copy that text, so it's copied. I'm gonna go back into Speechify, um, and then I'm gonna hit plus, copy text, and then boom. This is the text that was in my Kindle book a second ago. Los Angeles for more than 10 years, I had always admired Tommy Lasorda, the former manager of the Los Angeles Dodgers, especially since the time Mark Victor Hansen and I co-authored Chicken Soup for the baseball fans so with him, but in reading about how he quickly recognized Christian as a young baseball prodigy and befriended and supported him and his... So, it's less than ideal. We wish that you could import an entire Kindle book at once, but if, for example, you're using Speechify for homework and you wanna upload one chapter at a time, you can do that. And if you have the patience to upload one chapter at a time for an entire book, you could definitely do that as well. I know for me, it's better to do it this way than to actually do the physical reading.